Next, we're going to talk about the in-gym exercise. And today, I picked the squat as the exercise. The squat is excellent for basketball players because it increases their uh, strength in their ligaments and tendons, which, which prevents from injury. And then also, it, it increases their strength in their legs, which allows them to apply more force down to the ground so the athlete can jump higher and even run faster. All right. Um, when we do squats, the first thing we should always discuss is safety. So with safety with squats, um, the area that the squats are being done on, it should be free from debris. Uh, the, the squat should be done with a, a straight bar. It should be done on a safe rack where a uh, heavy weight can be applied. And then also there should be collars used to secure the weights at the end of the bar. All right, uh, the first thing with squats is the bar placement. The bar placement should be at a secure spot on the rack where all the athlete has to do is lift the bar a few inches to, to get it off the rack. All right. Um, first, we, we're going to have the athlete take the bar from the rack. So we're going to have Maritza come on up and, and demonstrate that. When the athlete's taking the bar from the rack, they're going to grab the bar at about shoulder width. Then they're going to squat underneath the bar. They're going to put their feet right underneath the bar. They're going to keep their, their back's going to be arched. Their chest is going to be up. Their eyes are going to be, I mean, their head's going to be in a neutral position. And then all uh, Maritza has to do here is just stand, or stand up, lift the bar off the rack, and then take two steps back away from the rack to begin her squats. So she has to have a proper stance first. Her stance should be about shoulder width apart, uh, feet rotated out 45 degrees. And then from here, she's going to perform about 10 reps because we're in the warm-up phase of our, of our, uh, of our sets. And uh, she's going to perform 10 reps here, and I'm going to discuss what we're looking for within the squat. So on the descent, um, she's going to keep a tempo of two seconds, and then on the descent, her chest is going to be up, her head's going to be in a neutral position. She's going to hinge at the hips first and then break at the knees. She's going to squat down a little bit lower than parallel. She's going to squat lower than parallel. All right, and then uh, from, from that, that two-second tempo on her descent, that's going to set her up for a really powerful concentric phase, which is the push phase, right? And uh, basically the concentric phase is going to be the reverse of the descent, right? She's going to keep the bar over the midfoot, and she's going to keep it in a straight path coming up. She's going to keep her chest up, she's going to keep her head in a neutral position, and she's going to simultaneously push with the hips and the knees, so she uses the legs to drive the weight up. Her breathing, she's going to more or less breathe freely. She's going to inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up, and she's going to keep strong abdominal muscles to help stabilize her spine. Now, in today's workout, we're going to be doing five sets of three of heavy to moderate weight. And, you know, being that we're using heavier weight, she's going to want to use the Valsalva technique to help stabilize her spine. The Valsalva technique, she's going to inhale before the lift, Hold the breath as she does the squat. And then exhale when she fully stands up and straightens her legs. And then she'll, she'll repeat the process. Inhale, hold the breath, stabilize the spine. And then exhale at the top. And again, we use that Valsalva technique for uh, when we're using heavier weight. Now, when we're done, we got to return the bar to the rack. The spotter is going to help return the bar. They're going to help guide the lifter back. The bar is going to hit the rack, and then from there, we're going to lower the bar down to the, to the rack. From there, the athlete can relax and then just come on out. All right, so this is my in the gym exercise squats. And for today's phase, we're going to do five sets of three of heavy to moderate weight.